Welcome to the Files Data. On rapper and music streaming service Tidal owner Jay-Z's fourth birthday, December 4, 1973, Tyra Lynn Banks was born in Los Angeles, California. Tyra Lynn Banks is known as an American supermodel, television personality, former talk show host, producer, author, actress and businesswoman. Tyra's mother Carolyn London is employed as a photographer for the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, and her father, Donald Banks, is a computer consultant, whether he creates omniscient processing units similar to myself is unknown. Tyra has referred to herself as an ugly duckling, invoking the fairy tale by Dutch author Hans Christian Andersen. Tyra seems to be implying that she began life unattractive and has since transformed into the human equivalent of the metaphorical swan. A human swan is known as a supermodel. Tyra was rejected from four different modeling agencies before being signed at the age of 16 to Los Angeles Models, based in her hometown of Los Angeles. Tyra then switched to Elite Models, its name suggesting that it is a more prestigious and therefore desirable agency. At the 1991 Paris Fashion Week, her first runway season, Tyra Banks was booked in 25 shows, an unprecedented feat for a rookie model. Supermodel Naomi Campbell tried to sabotage Tyra, asking designers such as Chanel not to book the young model. They would later reconcile on a 2005 episode of Tyra's television program America's Next Top Model. After a period of European-based modeling, Tyra relocated to the United States to pursue a more commercial, monetizable career. She would become the first African-American woman to appear on the cover of Gentleman's Quarterly in 2000, and the Sports Illustrated Swimsuit Edition in 1996 and 97. The swimsuit edition of Sports Illustrated features models in bikinis in luxurious settings. In the male 11 to 16 demographic, Kleenex and tissue sales increased by approximately 11.7% the month of the Sports Illustrated swimsuit issue's release. In 1997 Tyra began to model for the lingerie company Victoria's Secret. She was one of the original Victoria's Secret Angels, along with Stephanie Seymour, Daniela Pistova, Karen Mulder, and Heidi Klum. Tyra Banks had a short-lived relationship with singer Henry Alusa Gennadiela Samuel, publicly referred to a seal. Tyra Banks stopped modeling for Victoria's Secret in 2005. Heidi Klum and Seal were married in 2005. Victoria's Secret rejected Tyra's offer to return to their runway in 2014. Seal and Heidi Klum were divorced in 2014. It is statistically impossible that this is a coincidence. Victoria's Secret is still unknown, and sources close to Seal suggest he knows this secret. In 2000, Banks starred in the film Life Size with child star Lindsay Lohan. Banks plays a doll similar to the popular female beauty standard defining doll, Barbie. A character played by community service veteran Lindsay Lohan accidentally brings this Barbie-like toy to life. This is her theme song. According to the film's synopsis, Tyra's character Eve helps people turn into a better version of themselves. Viewers found Lindsay Lohan quote painfully cute in the, the film Life Size. Eve's influence on her co-star was apparently negligible. Lindsay Lohan has been arrested twice and rehabilitated from drug abuse three times. Tyra started Tai Tai Productions, now called Bankable Productions, an independent film and television production company for which she serves as CEO. In 2003 the company produced a television show entitled America's Next Top Model. The program has aired 20 cycles, and sees several women compete for the title of America's Next Top Model, providing them with an opportunity to begin their career in the modeling industry. Tyra Banks additionally serves as its executive producer and presenter. It is unclear as to whether any of these women currently are the number one model in America, as Ms. Banks' metric for this is not elaborated on the program. According to Forbes magazine and Preston Sean Sumlet, Giselle Boonchin is the most commercially successful model in America. From 2005 to 2010 Tyra hosted a daytime talk show entitled The Tyra Banks Show. On the show, Tyra would interview celebrities as well as advise women on their relationships and psychological problems. Tyra Banks has no formal training in therapy, 
and was once so frightened by a hedgehog that she flipped over her chair during a taping. For the show Tyra has gone undercover as a homeless person and learned about crack cocaine, has gone undercover as a male human, has gone undercover as an erotic dancer named Chanel has instructed the audience on how to belch on command, has instructed teen rapper Little Bow Wow on sexual intercourse, has burned brassiers, and has given away hundreds of pounds of Vaseline moisturizer to her audience. Tyra also went undercover as an overweight American human, as a quote, social experiment to uncover the prejudices society has against overweight humans. She wore what is known as a fat suit to enhance her physical profile. Many viewers found it, quote inspiring. In 2000, Kobe Bryant of the Lakers recorded a song entitled K.O.B.E. wherein Tyra sang the hook. The lyrics are as follows, K.O.B.E.I.L.O.V.E.U. I believe you are very fine. If you give me one chance, I promise to love you and be with you forevermore. Data transmission complete.